This is Manchester United's main problem on the defensive transition. And here is my proposal for a temporary fix. Y'all know how much I love Casemiro. He's one of my favorite DMs in time all. And while at times this season, he's still shown us the class, the first touch passes in tight spaces to progress the transition forward. While that's still intact, it seems like father time has taken a yard off his pace. So many fans are saying Eric Ten Hag isn't brave enough to go finish off teams. Well, here's one of the reasons why it's so tough to just thump everybody forward. Many a times, even when in a favorable 3v2 situation, the 1v1 with the opposition forward, and so fast with Casemiro getting beaten for pace. And when that happens, who's behind him? These are not bad players, but we just don't have the balance in this squad and that back line. There's so many players injured. What can you do to remediate this imbalance? Here's what I think. Kobe Mino is a young lad. He can only do so much. There was a moment in the early half this season where we saw Diogo Dallo playing at left back. Rather than being the inverted fullback making the overlapping runs, we saw Diogo Dallo tucking in centrally and almost kind of being the holding the double pivot alongside Casemiro and whether he's doing the ball carrying job or just slotting right next to Casemiro to, to provide defensive stability this inverting role actually provided better control in the midfield for Manchester United but with Erwan Basaka unavailable right now what do we do we keep Diogo Dallo in the right back role he has been phenomenal let's not chop and change so much when things are going well if anything Victor Lindelof isn't known for his pace he's not known for his strength he's known for his control and what I want to see from Victor Lindelof rather than inverting and rather than being the fullback bombarding and constantly making these awkward runs why don't we just operate him the same way that we did prior to and let him sit alongside Casemiro so that he at least has an extra body this provides a lot more stability in terms of Casemiro not being the last man being called out and allowing Diogo Dallo to sort of push forward and have this back four sit here allow Man United's front six here to dictate on the opposition half but what do you guys think get in the comments and let me know